Let's add your first node and navigate to the text input. You can move around by simply clicking and dragging and control your zoom via the scroll wheel or these three buttons on the side. We are gonna turn text into an image. So let's create another node by right clicking the canvas and navigating to a text to image model. Now all we need to do is drag from one to the other to connect them. Let's create a cybernetic dog. This will cost us only two credits, so let's generate it. There we go, nice, a cool cybernetic dog within seconds. Let's expand this one step further by turning it into a video. Drag out from the image output and select an image to video model. To delete a node, select it and press delete. The same applies for any node connections. So now let's make the dog be surprised and run away. Nice, congratulations on making your first flow. In the bottom right, you can download your generation or even share it via a link. Additionally, you can directly view all your generations from this flow in the asset browser on the left. Oh, and one final thing, head up to the top left to select a name for your flow, as well as the thumbnail by right clicking any generation and pressing user's thumbnail. If you get stuck at any point or want to explore further, you can access our AI assistant through this button on the right hand side. This will bring up a chat window where you can ask it for help or to create flows for you. You can even ask it to batch create you the same workflow with different inputs. For example, generating many of the characters from Harry Potter in a specific style. You can start new chats, view old chats and exit the window all from the bar at the top too. Flow sharing is a huge part of what we value at SOTA, a community of creators sharing their work. So let's help you share yours as well as use any other community flows. To share a flow, press the share button in the top right. From here, you can post on socials with one click or copy the link and share it with your community. If someone sends you a link to their flow, clicking on it will open it as a preview. Here you can explore their work, but to edit their flow, you just need to press the remix button in the bottom right. And it's that simple.